Hey, how's it going everybody? Flinger Foo here. And today we're going to jump into a game, a uh, new game, Sheltered. Well, it's not really new, it's been out for a while, uh, it came out in March. Um, and I've been waiting to uh, jump into it and to play it and see ex exactly what it's like. Uh, it looks really cool. Um, and this is from the Steam page, this is the description. Shelters is a deep and emotional survival management game. You take on the role of protecting your four family members who, after a global apocalypse, have found their way to a de deserted shelter. And so that's where we're at. So you know what? Let's just jump into a game. Um, I've, just, I've just installed it, loaded it up, and hey, you know what? I want to. I'm really interested in seeing how this game turns out. All right. So let's see what we got. Uh, slot one empty. All right. Uh, customize family and sheltered. You look after a family of two adults and two children before you begin. You can customize how each individual looks, set their traits, and also their stats. Traits and stats govern how the characters act. For example, a character with high strength is especially powerful in melee combat. Select help on the character customization screen to see detailed explanations on stats and traits. That's cool. I like that. Oh, okay. So first character is Joyce. Uh, gender. Let's see. Uh, well, what we got? We can go next and back. Okay, so Joyce and Anthony. All right, so uh, top color. Okay. Um, you know what? She's... Um, no, let's see. She's going to be... She's going to like wearing black. All right, even though... Um, yeah. All right, and uh, let's see. Gender, top color, bottom color. Bottom color. Black and... Not green. Green's my colors. All right, so... Okay, we'll go with that. Skin color. Eh, doesn't really matter here. Let's go with that one. Uh, hair color. All right. Head type. Oh, oh, hey, yeah. Cool. All right, body type. Let's see. Sure, why not? Uh, legs. Does she have... She has legs. There we go. All right. Traits. What has she got? Optimistic. Let's see. Hands-on. Optimistic. Resourceful. Hygienic. Small eater. Courageous. Deep sleeper. Proactive. Ah, I, I like proactive. I just like the way that sounds. How does this... All right. What's uh, proactive? Proactive moves faster in the shelter and whilst exploring. Okay. Um... Food re rations relieve more hunger. Courageous first two attacks and an attack to kill are guaranteed to hit. Wow, hey, that could be pretty... All right, tiredness stat decreases faster when when sleeping. Okay. Um, craft and fix faster. Hands-on, optimistic, gain stress. You know, she's going to be optimistic because I... Yeah, I'm going to go optimistic. Optimistic, like me, right? Right, right. Uh, stats preset. Um, well educated, athletic. Um, let's see. That has a high dexterity. Uh, troubled. <laughs> Street smart. Hey, all right. Um, logical. And I have a feeling the first one's gonna take me the longest. The rest of them I can just blow through. I hope. All right, let's go logical on her. Can I rename her to not? Bob. All right, there you go. Okay, so we have the first ones. Not Bob. Can you guess what this guy's name is going to be? Bob. All right. Um, I do not like that. All right, so let's see. Top color. Uh, let's go silver, bottom color. Uh, that's the greenish. That's kind of a dark green, gray. Uh, yeah, okay, we'll go with that. Skin color doesn't really matter. There we go. Uh, hair color. There we go. All right, uh, head type. What kind of head do you have? There we go. There we go. All right, Bob's got a beard. All right, body type. There we go, long sleeve shirts. Just like me, always wearing long sleeve shirts. Sure, that works. Uh, traits. Hands-on, proactive. I'm going to go courageous with this guy because that one actually sounded cool. All right, stats preset. 
well-rounded, um, violent. <laughs> All right. Uh, um, good upbringing. Well-educated. All right. Athletic. I think I like athletic with this guy. Trouble. <laughs> Ten strength. Street smart. Logical. Well-rounded. Violent. Let's go with... What was that one? Let's go athletic with this dude. All right. Bob is athletic. All right, next. Okay, we got the first kid. Carl. All right. No, your name's not Carl. Your name's Bert. There you go, Bert. All right. Uh, let's see. Top color. Yeah, you know, everything in there looks good. Uh, oh, hey, he's got different ones. Brain box. Okay, the kids have different uh, ones. Small eater. Deep sleeper. Proactive. Okay, he's proactive. And hyper. Proact oh, what was that last one? Brain box. See up here, this is what I'm reading. Uh, brain box. Uh, hyper. That one's kind of cool. A bully? No. Alert. That could be kind of good. Smarty pants. <laughs> know it all. All right. Rough and tumble. Well spoken. Um, let's see. How come hyper isn't intelligent? All right, they have like a one intelligence. All right, we're gonna go smarty pants with this dude. All right, and who are you? Jeffrey, no, you're gonna be female. There we go. And Jeffrey is not gonna be your name. So let's see, we have Bob, not Bob, Bert, and I could go Ernie, but no, I'm not gonna go Ernie. I'm gonna go for the girl, Bubba. There we go. All right. When she talks, she talks like this. All right. Because I like that. All right. Hands on, optimistic, resourceful. Let's go resourceful for her. All right. Uh, stats preset, bully, alert. She'll be alert. She'll be the, the, you know, the paranoid, scaredy one that's, no, no, because she's not very smart. Know it all. Rough and tumble. Well spoken. Brain box. There we go. We need one that's at least smart, right? All right, so we'll go with that. Yeah, the Lynch family. No. They're the Foo family. Pet's name, Beetle? Uh. No, let's see. Uh, pet's name. Hmm. Trying to think of all my available names here. Blacking out. All right, we'll go Dodo. I like Dodo. All right, uh, pets. A fish. No, it's a snake. The snake has the ability to keep rats away. Whilst the snake is out of his vivarium, no rats will come to the shelter, even whilst it is dirty. Requires feeding. Whilst in this, whilst in this vivarium... I don't know why I'm tumbling over my English right now. Every other day, beware it bites. Beware its bite. Oh, okay. A horse? How are we going to get a horse in a shelter? Man's best friend can be taken out with you on expeditions to increase your perception and help you in combat. Provides a small stress reduction to all family members. Passive effect. Requires daily feeding. All right, what do we got here? A cat is a natural hunter. Excellent at killing rats. Any rats it kills will be transferred into... A freezer, if freezer space is available. Provides a small stress reduction to all family members. Passive effect. Requires feeding every other day. I kind of like having the cat. No goldfish. No snake. Well, we're going to go with a cat. Even though I, intuition tells me I should go with a dog, I'm going to go with the cat. And I'm going to rename Dodo to my cat. Indy. All right. Yeah, you hear me over there in your box. Just chill out, dude. It's all right. All right, so let's start up. Do you want to play the tutorial? Yes, of course I do. All right, loading. Tra tip, traveling through forests and mountains reduces a party's travel speed. Well, okay. So what do we got here? All right, let me move this screen up a little bit. Uh, it keeps wanting to clip. Okay, so what do we got? Oh, there we go. Okay. So what, 
Look around the shelter by moving the cursor to the edge of the screen with the mouse or move the camera with arrow keys. Okay, zoom in and out with left control or just use the mouse wheel, right? Yes. Okay. So, oh. Oh, okay. Uh, highlight an object and press right mouse to interact with it. The shelter is powered by a petrol generator. Okay. So I can interact. Add fuel. Yes, add fuel. All right, so what is this? What is this? Oh, okay. So then she takes time adding the fuel. And then... <laughs> Obviously, mousing over her uh, reduces her... Yeah. It just whites her out. Whites everything out. All right. Spread work across the family to avoid tiring. Highlight a family member and press left mouse to select them. You can also use Q and E to cycle through all of your shelter members. All right, so let's go through him. Regularly fix items to prevent them breaking. Remember, highlight an object and press right mouse to interact with it. Okay, so I can right mouse and fix that. All right, you go to work, Bob. All right, and so, okay, so there's her. So what do we do here? What's this? What's this? What's, hey, what's that? All right, this icon will appear, will appear over any items that are in need of repair. Okay, gotcha. Okay, so... There we go. All right. It's even more important to look after the family. Remember, highlight a family member and press left mouse to select them. You can also use Q and E to cycle through all of your um, shelter members. Okay. Gotcha. Select not Bob for this task. There you go, girl. All right. So now what do you do? Stats show the character is thirsty. Okay. Over here. Oh, she's got that and that. Thirst. Okay. Uh, hunger. Her thirst is in the red. Gotcha. Oh, she doesn't need to use the toilet yet. Hunger, tiredness. All right, so she can drink the water from the water butt. You drink that water butt, girl. You go, girl. All right. And now, all right, your goal is to survive for as long as possible. I have a feeling that's not going to be that long. You can explore, expand, maintain the shelter, and keep the family healthy to help achieve this. Explore and gather resources by using the radio transmitter to set up an expedition. Okay. That. I'm Keep an eye out for that icon. I'll probably need your help finding it later. All right. Expand the shelter and work around new items with the workbench. Okay. Your next step might be to explore, to build, or check on your family. How you survive is up to you. Well, all right. Oh, there's that. What's that? That's the journal. I can... View journal. Day one. Made it. Barely. It's just us, now, together. Our family consists of not Bob, Bob, Bert, Bubba, and our pet cat, Indy. I can't believe we found this place. It's a bit rough around the edges, but it will provide good protection from the elements. Hopefully no one finds us down here. We just want some peace. And to live. We want to live. All right, what's this? Radio transmitter. Upgrade, set up expedition, broadcast, scan for... Hey, that's kind of cool. All right, so um, do I like assign someone to that? Or what's this? That's the radio transmitter. What's this? Hazmat suits. I have hazmat. Intercom. All right. What's this? Shelter door. What's this? Workbench. I found the workbench. All right. Uh, what Can I craft stuff? Building and upgrading. Building new systems and upgrading is important as they will help you run your shelter more efficiently. You can find items out in the wasteland and then use them to upgrade or create new items here. You can also expand your shelter by crafting new rooms in the workbench. You craft new rooms there. Okay. Cool. Kooky. All right, so this is all the stuff. I, the green check is stuff I have. The red check is stuff I need. Yes? No? Oh, it's stuff I can craft. And the red stuff is stuff I can't because I'm missing these items. Gotcha. Nailed that. All right. So tier two. Can't even do that yet. That special. Hey, nothing special. You guys got nothing special. All right, Foo family. All right, what is this? A rat trap. Uh, incinerator. Destroy excess items. Okay. Tiny pantry. Makeshift shower. Bucket toilet. Hey, hey who doesn't like going crap in a, to in a bucket? Small water butt. A grave. Oh, no. Mop and bucket. What is this? Digging the grave on the surface will allow dead humans to be buried away. Burying a body in a grave will avoid family members suffering trauma. Oh, gotcha. Gas mask. Sleeping bag. I have a feeling my people are dying while I'm busy talking about a ladder. Metal ladder used to move between levels. Uh... Shelter room, a large con. Oh, I can build a shelter room. Snare trap. You know what? Let's build a room. 
How do we build a room? Build it here. You, you're, you've just assigned your shelter member of job. Jobs appear next to selected members' portraits, and you have a maximum of two jobs in the queue. Jobs include. I didn't want. Oh, did no, no, no. Get back. I no, I did not want that. How, how do I? Hey, wait! Going out of the service without a hazmat suit can be hazardous to your health. Remember to put on one of these. Get back there. Oops. There you go. All right, get back in there. Cancel. I did not want that. All right, so what is this? And they don't have any food or anything like that? Okay, so you know what? Let's get her. Can we have her work on... Expand the shelter and build new items with the workbench. Gotcha. Scan frequencies. I have no clue what that's going to do, but hey. Let's have you... Uh... All right, so we have that. We have more fuel there. Light dust storm on surface. Gotcha. Okay. Indy, where are you going, dude? See, I'm already lost here. All right. Uh, let's have her go down. Let's have him go down here. All right. And then... Let's have him... Uh, craft an item, and then, let's see, can we, snare trap, no, shelter room, okay, there we go, all right, gotcha, all right, so let's build that there, all right, you go, Bob, all right, so what are you doing, you know what, let's have you craft an item, and then we need beds, right, beds are a thing here, sleeping bag, all right, oh, makeshift shower, uh, we can craft a bed, right, all right, let's craft that, all right, what are you doing? Oh, what is that? A camper van? Check vehicle. Sturdy set of wheels. The RV offers a huge storage capacity for wasteland expeditions and requires less water than traveling by foot. The RV uses petrol and cannot be taken on expeditions without any. Once you have found all the parts in the RV, you can choose to use it at in the expedition screen setup. Gotcha. Takes it. Wow. That's a lot. But hey, you know what? That sounds like fun. All right, what is that? Water filter. Integrity, 68%. All right, so you know what? Let's have you get that. Take suit. You can move objects, mo most of the objects around in the shelter by going to the workbench and selecting rearrange shelter. Y you can also... Who's tired? Who's tired? Okay, tiredness prevents them from taking part in activities that gain experience. Gotcha. All right, so who is tired? Are you the tired one? Where's tiredness? Tiredness, right there. All right. No. All right, well, let's have you put back return suit. All right. Oh, it's a rabbit. I should have built that snare. All right, and then you go to sleep. Be gone with ye. All right. So let's... He's feeling okay. What's her? She's feeling okay. Tiredness meter, food. Do we have any... Any anything? We have no food or anything, do we? All right, small crate. What's in the... No, oh, this is storage. Okay, so in this storage, we have gas masks, bandages, empty petrol can, rubber... Rope. I love how it's in the shape of a noose. All right. Uh, plastic. Buckets. Batteries. Anti-radiation tablets. Nylon. Valve. Wood. Okay. No weapons or anything. Huh. Duct tape. All right. Gotcha. All right. So while he's building that, I probably should have not had him build that. Getting thirsty. I remember... Shelter member is thirsty. Drinking water is important. Okay, and that would be... Oh, he's the one that's tired. Let's have you drink some water, Bob. No, we haven't left the shelter for a few days. I get it. Alright? I'm trying to figure out what's going on. Alright, so what is this? This is...
Okay. Did not yield any information. Gotcha. Okay. So with him, I'm gonna have him... Hey! There you go! Alright. Let's see. Have him go down here. Craft item. I can craft another sleeping bag, or do I want... Let's see. Wool, nylon, wood, pipe, valve. Okay, so it's not going to... Um, let's see. Let's put that there. Okay. So you craft that so you can get him. I can hear the cat. Can you hear the cat? <laughs> That's kind of cool. Alright, so he's thirsty. Hunger. How do you solve hunger? Don't worry, Bob. Your bed's going. All right, so bomb. Let's go with that. Sleep. All right, and as soon as he wakes up, I'm going to send him out on expedition, I think. See how that works. All right, so he's sleeping. He's taking a long time, and then she's sleeping. She should wake up, and I'll have her be the crafter and him being the... Yes, I get it, All right? Yeah, keep calm, Bert. Uh-oh, she needs to use the toilet. All right, so let's get him, actually, let's get her to build craft item. Uh, we need a bucket. This is going to be the bathroom, I think. So as close to there as possible. There we go. All right. And then you, Bert, you can uh, craft item. Shower. Close to that as possible. There we go. All right. Keeping it clean. What's that smell? I think somebody needs a shower. Gotcha. All right. Um, poor hygiene leads to stress and in severe cases, food poisoning. So it's important that they wash themselves from time to time. Okay. So Bob's still sleeping. And then how, how are you doing? You need to drink. Drink some water. All right. And then he needs sleep. And then she needs a shower, but she's busy craft. He's busy crafting the shower. So let's see what else can we craft? A mop and bucket, a grave, a small water butt, a ladder, tiny pantry, twenty rations of food. Okay. So let's see. Um, we can just craft this up here. All right, you go up there, girl. And he keeps saying we haven't left it in a couple days. It's only day two. All right, someone's lying here. Heading into the wasteland. In order to survive, you'll need to upgrade your shelter systems by gathering parts and resources. The best way to do this is to set up an expedition and go out hunting for them. That's what I plan to do. But, looks like we have the parts to upgrade a system. Which system? Upgrade. You can upgrade your shelter's efficiency by upgrading your oxygen filter, generator, and water filter. The shelter's doors can also be upgraded to help against shelter breaches. That sounds very important. All right, so this right here requires to that and this. All right, so I could go there, but that would... No, I don't. I need hinges and rope. Okay, gotcha. So now what is this? Upgrade. What does this take? Decontamination, durability, efficiency. Leather. Okay. All right, so now... All right, you're done with that, and you need to sleep. So you sleep. Okay, you need a shower. Take shower. You need to you need a shower too but you're gonna have to wait you're gonna be smelling in that suit all right and then i'm gonna send her out here to uh fix this water filter this is this is actually kind of cool i'm really digging it <laughs> this 
so far this game is kind of fun. It's really, really heavy on the micromanagement so far. I'm kind of, yeah. Wow. So I'm going to have to select two of them to go out adventuring and two of them to stay here and basically maintain the whole area. So I think I have... Let's see, the father and the daughter, I think. Yeah, Bubba. All right, she's going to need to sleep. I'll get her well rested. I won't overwork Bob. So uh, Bubba and Bob, they're going to be the exploration team. And uh, Bert and not Bob. Yeah, we're fixing it, dude. Okay. And also, I'm going to leave her up there to uh, upgrade that as well. And let's upgrade the... Uh, can't do the efficiency. Oh, it's going to use up a bunch of my pipes. Okay. Uh, let's go durability. Okay. So... See, you can fix that, right? Okay, yeah, I know. You need to sleep. All right, she's upgrading that now. As soon as she's done, she's going to come in and take a shower while they go to sleep. But as soon as he wakes up, these two are going out. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I'm already... <laughs> I got a... Oh, okay, he needs to use the toilet. All right, never... don't mind him. He's just going to go uh, use toilet. And she needs a shower. Yeah, she's saying, hey, give me a shower. And she needs to sleep. And she needs to shower too. Or no, Bob needs. Oh, he's just using the... Alright, so he rocks on the toilet going, It's gonna be okay, it's gonna be okay. <laughs> Alright, uh, automated shelter members will take care of their own hunger, thirst, toilet... Tiredness and hygiene needs. Press H or home to switch automate. Okay. So what what do you need now? Bob needs a shower. Bob, take that shower. All right, you're stinky dude. And you need to sleep. Day three. All right. <laughs> oh man. All right. So he needs water. Do I even have any water? Drink water. Do we even have any? We don't have any water. All right. So, let's get her back inside. Let's get him. What does he need now? Oh, you need a shower. All right, so I'm going to take. have you take a shower, dude. All right? But, hey, I think that's going to do that for this first episode. Oh, you. Get in. Put that suit away. Return suit. All right. And uh, tomorrow, we're going to send these guys out on their first expedition. Oh my gosh. All right. So, hey, uh, yeah. Um, let me see if I can get my bearings. And, dude, why can't you? All right. Fix the shower, dude. All right. So, hey, I'll see you guys next time. And until then, it's Flinger Foo. And take it easy, everyone. My gosh.